the multi-line style command. Open one bit template that was created in article creating a new template. Use the multi-line style command to create style of multi-line. You can select the multi-line style tool to click format menu and select multi-line style. Select the multi-line style tool. This opens the multi-line style dialog box. In the styles window you can see standard, the name of the current multi-line style, which includes two continuous line elements that you can see in the preview window. Click the new button to create the new style. This opens the create new multi-line style dialog box. Type new in the new style name edit box and click the continue button. This opens the new multi-line style dialog box. Move this dialog box to the right to open the preview window of the multi-line style dialog box. You can see properties of the elements of the standard style on the right side of the dialog box. Offset is 0.5 means that the line stays 0.5 above the original point. Offset is minus 0.5 means that the line stays 0.5 below the original point. The color and the line type are determined by whatever layer the multi-line is drawn on. You can see caps properties of the elements of the standard style on the left side of the dialog box. Click the Add button. A third element is added to the preview window. Notice that it is offset 0.0. .0. The new element also has by layer color and the line type. Click the By Layer button and select red color. Click the Line Type button to change the line type. This opens the Select Line Type dialog box. Click the Load button. Scroll down and select Hidden. Click the OK button. Select Hidden and uh, click OK button. This returns you to the new multi-line style dialog box. Select Caps properties as shown on the screen. Click the OK button. This opens the multi-line style dialog box. The middle element is added to the preview window and new style is added to the list of style. Click the Set Current button to set new as the current multi-line style. Click the OK button. Select Multi-Line tool and draw the object as shown on the screen. You can see result on the screen.